Hey guys, welcome to Crazy Burger. So in this video, I'm going to be looking at my top three games on the Capcom edition of the Super Pocket. Without further ado, let's get started. Okay guys, so I'm going to be looking at my top three go-to games on the Capcom edition of the Super Pocket. Um, and obviously in a future video, I will do a full ranking of all games on this device. Um, it's a pretty tricky choice, but I'll need to play through them a little bit more till I get my final ranking. Certainly is quite tricky, because there are a lot of really decent games here. Certainly something for everyone. Um, I certainly enjoyed quite a few of these games. Um, some of them I'm not really that keen on, like I'm not that keen on Mega Man. Um, but I know a lot of people really love it. Hyper Fighting, Super Fighter 2, I'd rather it was a probably different edition, but I guess with the easy mode it certainly makes things a little bit more bearable, because it is a pretty tough version of Street Fighter 2. Um, but without further ado, let's look at my top three. And starting at number three, we have Captain Commando, an excellent scrolling beat em up. Let's have a look at it. Great, they can choose from four characters. It certainly has Final Fight vibes uh, going through it, a lot of sound effects. Graphics similar similarities um, with the Final Fight series, um, and it's pretty decent. I'm not saying it's as good as Final Fight, um, but it's really good fun. Certainly, lots of variety with the fighting, and the fact that you can jump into like mechs is pretty cool, and you can destroy the backgrounds. A nice addition as well. Great fun, really, really cool. It's definitely one of those games I need to play a lot more of. Um, on this device, but yeah, it's fantastic. Really, really good. Oh, speaking of mechs, here we go. <laughs> I'm not sure it actually helps by going on these things, but there's no doubt it's fun. Ah, didn't last long, did I? Ah. I love the fact you've got weapons as well, you've got guns as well in this game, which is obviously really cool. Yeah, but wow, excellent, excellent game. Really is good fun. I mean, arguably you could even rate this as one of the, the top games on here, but yeah, I'm going to stick it in number three just now. Um, it's really good, but there's a couple of games I think are slightly better than this. So let's have a look at number two. The number two is... 1944 The Loopmaster. I think this is absolutely fantastic. And this is pretty good coming from me because I'm not really a big shoot 'em up fan at all, but I think this game is really good. I absolutely thoroughly enjoy it. And I've played it obviously on the XP and a few other devices as well, and it's always been a great blast to play through. It's actually even better as a two player game, which sadly, obviously, we cannot do uh, on the Super Pockets. It would be nice if we found a way to link up a couple of devices, but anyway. Right now it's really just all about the single player. Like I say guys, there's no right or wrong answer here. Everyone will have their own personal favourites of what they like to play on these devices. Um, and definitely these are my go-to games. The graphics on this is fantastic. Great sound effects too. Uh, and the playability is just fun. It's such a blast. Um, and so you've got your special move which just light up this screen and makes it completely pop. Absolutely brilliant stuff. <laughs> Chasing about the these um, bonuses are a complete hoot. Yeah, I'm not really great at these type of games, but I certainly still enjoy this one. It's fantastic fun. What's not to love about this game, guys? Absolutely superb. You don't even need to love shooters, and I certainly don't, but this is great fun. I'm just still not very good at it, though. I think anyone that watches this channel will know what my top pick's going to be. It's pretty obvious, and it's Final Fight. An absolute all-time favourite. Might be even my all-time favourite arcade game. Um, absolutely loved it back in the arcades. Even played two-player sometimes as well, which was great fun. But in the two-player game, they kind of just doubled up with the bosses at times with you. So it, it was helpful, but sometimes not. Cody was always my go-to player too. But I usually switch between all of them anyway, at some points, once you lose your lives. But certainly my first go-to player was always Cody. Interesting though, guys. What was your go-to player in Final Fight? Guy? Hager? 
Cody? Anyone play the SNES versions? Final Fight 2 and 3? I really need to give those more time to be honest. I've only played them very briefly. But not having a SNES I never grew up with, I had a Mega Drive which obviously had Streets of Rage series which I absolutely loved. But for me this was definitely the better game. More so the arcade version. The Sega Mega CD version was really really good, but um, yeah, arcade's still the top version. And this is great on the Super Pocket. Um, doesn't really come across that well on the screen, but the colours really pop on this. Absolutely terrific. Looks fantastic. So guys, let me know what are your top three picks on the Capcom edition of the Super Pocket. Again, there's no right or wrong answers here. It's really just a personal choice at the end of the day. I look forward to a future video. I will rank all the games on this device um, after I've gave them a good playthrough and I'll make my final decision. Um, anyway guys, thanks very much for watching. I'll catch you again in the next one. Bye for now.